Hi everyone, I got the summer 2020 seasonal surprise box from Erin Condren today. I am so excited to get into this. I've watched some of the videos, just not the ones that didn't have any spoilers in it, so I'm excited to get into this. I hope that you stick around and join me. and welcome to my channel I'm Nancy so thank you for joining me just wanted to put this little insert in be before I get started on my Erin Condren my summer seasonal box this is a top that I got from a Transcend box uh, early in this week and I'm going to make a decision tonight on what I'm keeping or not so I originally didn't think I liked it too much um, it just I tried it on with a skirt that had these asymmetrical um, stripes, the black and white stripes with the tie-dye, and because then this is horizontal and then the stripes were in different places, it just kind of threw me off and I wasn't crazy about it. But um, I do like the concept of this top and it wasn't my wish my wish, uh, my wish, wish list or whatever you call it on the Upper East Side, so I wanted to try it on with something else. And of course this is my Saturday or Sunday go-to outfit after I do my chores. This cute little camo skirt also from uh, Transcend, loving this. So I tried it on with this. It does have this side knot right here. And it's uh, one of those tops that you really can't like pull up to your waist and then pull down again because then this knot just gets in the way. But I think down like this, it still gives it a nice shape. I do have these little tiny bat wings, but I'm trying to decide, is it enough to really bother me? And the answer is probably gonna be no, it's not gonna be bothering me that much. They're not big gaping. Uh, bat wings but they do kind of look annoying sometimes but when it's 100 degrees outside and I'm wearing this with this and I'm in the house under the air conditioning and no one's going to see me is it going to bother me no not really if I wear it to work is it going to bother me no not really because everybody's still remotely work remotely working from home there's only a couple of us in the office at a time the air conditioner is on high so I usually have a sweater on anyway so I think I'm going to keep it but just wanted to let me know your thoughts on that and sometimes when I can't decide if I'm going to keep something or not from one of my boxes I just try it on with different uh, items that I have just to see if I can get a different look for it sorry for the white legs I'm home alone I am not, I didn't put nylon on today I know it's bad I'm bad but uh, anyway so this is the look so let me know your thoughts and we will like it to my own hundred video Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. Thank you to my subscribers, my viewers. I appreciate you more than you know. I love it when you stop in and visit from time to time. I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up. Your comments, of course, are always welcome. And if you are new to my channel, I hope that you click on that little red subscribe button right there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. And today I am going to be doing my Erin Condren, my seasonal summer box. This comes out four times a year and, and it's so out quick again I was kind of on the fence if I wanted to get it or not and um, at the last minute I decided to go for it and I think it sold out within four hours so anyway hoping for a great box but I think anything that I get I always love anyway I have got my caramel coffee my caramel vanilla creamer in here I am good to go I'm gonna have a sip first Actually, it was a beautiful day out here. It was really muggy earlier. I went out and um, my neighbors actually got my lawnmower going for me. And so he uh, opted to do my lawn for me again. He says, and by the way, um, how about if I just do your lawn and I'll do my lawn with your mower because it's a lot quicker and I'll put the gas in. And I'm like, okay, that's a no brainer. You, you got a deal. So anyway, lawnmower was going. So I weed whacked the bottom of my hill down here today. And uh, yeah, it was nice. It, it needed it. So glad I was able to get out, get some exercise done. And now the mugginess is gone. It's cooling off. I wanted a margarita, but it's coffee time because it's getting cool out here. But anyway, Erin Condren. So she does these seasonal surprise boxes. They come out four times a year. And uh, usually a couple of weeks before they go on sale, some of the uh, big YouTubers get the boxes early. Um, you know at no charge as a PR from Erin Condren and they're not allowed to tell you any spoilers or tell you what's in the box but they just kind of go through and tell you whether they think it's a good deal um, how many things are going to be exclusive to the box how many things are sneak peeks meaning that they'll end up at her store or online sooner or later 
So anyway, I was kind of like on the fence, and of course you really can't, they, because I can't tell you spoilers, you really don't know. But anyway, I did get it, and then after um, I did order it, and um, it became so that um, people were actually posting the videos. Um, I went to watch them, but I didn't watch them. I just kind of read the comments to kind of get an idea of what was in there. And people either loved it or they hated it. They were like, I'm so mad. I I ordered one. I want to send it all back. And other people were, oh, I wish I had ordered four. I would give them away as gifts. And other people were like, oh, I'm so happy I got mine. And so everybody's different. So you just have to check it out and try it for yourself. But anyway, the inside of the, the box, and they're always reversible. And there's always a nice little saying, something beautiful is on the horizon. You get the uh, little explanation of the summer surprise box. Some notes from Erin Condren herself. I don't think it's going to focus. And then on the back, she tells you, it just kind of goes into what's in the box. And then over, he oh, over here, it'll tell you whether it's a sneak peek, meaning it's going to show up at the store or online in the future, or exclusive, meaning it was made specifically for the kit. It won't be offered again. And one thing I notice is that everybody else seems to get a little sticker when they open the box, and I never do, so what's up with that? But anyway, it's on what's on the inside of the box, what counts, so... Anyway, that's what I have right now. This first item is a little bag here. Some pretty colors on it. So if I can see what this is. So it's a zippered pouch. It's a sneak peek. So this is going to be offered at the store eventually or online. So it's uh, kind of like a soft plastic kind of like one of those tablecloths that you would put on your table outside some beautiful colors little pool tab right here it's got rose gold zipper which is really pretty and inside it's kind of like that little soft belt lining so whether you use this for um, some of your planner supplies whether you used it for makeup or put stuff in your, your handbag so you don't have to keep taking everything out just a cute little bag so I love this and this is kind of coming up it's kind of like a rose gold gold and then some pink and then that bright sapphire blue so it is very pretty I think I will get some use out of that and we get some pens here the dual tip highlighter duo let's see if I can see this sneak peek dual tip this is a sneak peek meaning that they will be at the store sooner or later. Looks like maybe a blue and a gray. So let's see how they right here. Well, maybe that's not the best way to do it. You just use the highlighter. So it's like a blue and a soft gray. So some pretty colors on the right paper. So one would be for highlighting, one would be for writing. So that's that. And pocket scissors. And I did get some pocket scissors in another box recently. So let's see how these work. And pocket scissors. Uh, sleeve. So this is a sneak peek. So this will be available online or inner store as well. scissors okay so this little thing so good for carrying around if you wanted to put it in that handy dandy pouch or anything else you had and as you can see it's, it's cutting through this cardstock without any problem and I think some of the reasons that they're going to this and with this I think you can carry this on an airplane because you're limited by the um, the length of the blade so I think you can take this on an airplane but don't quote me on that and some stickers that are always going to be in your seasonal box and these are exclusive so i'm not going to unless they don't come out when i hold them up these are exclusive so these will always be something you can get only in the seasonal box not in erin condren so just some nice fun summer designs and let's see we got some glue tape 
language. Sometimes I do struggle trying to lay my pictures down. Glue tape. Do, 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 speak. There's my card. I can't find it. Clear glitter. No. Blue tape, sneak peek. So this is going to be available in the stores. So this you would just put down on the back of your pictures or any quotes that maybe you want from a sticker book that you wanted to put in. Make it easy to put in your planner. So I will get some use out of that. And I think some people were complaining that she was getting more into supplies instead of fun things. So I think maybe this is what they were complaining about. But you get something like this in a box, I'm going to use that. So I'm not complaining. And if it works for me, then it's something that I'm going to get in the future. So this is a little note paper. I don't know if it's a sticky paper or not. But this is a note cube. This is a sneak peek, so it will be available in the stores. It just has that layers design from the new book. Well, I'll open it later and let you know that if it, this is uh, like post-its or just a note paper. And this is a sticker book, sticker paper sticker book. This is exclusive, so this is not going to be available in the store. So let's check this out. I think I saw one of these in a in an older haul that I had watches to see what things came in it. So it was different than what I thought it would be, but it's got again like that layers with the, the blue background and then the uh, gold. Alrighty. So okay. So anyway, and it's a full sheet, so they're not individual stickers. So you can use these however you want. And they're probably, if you had the uh, colorful one, these probably match with the months. So that if you wanted to use it for washi, you could just cut, and it's got the graph paper on the back so that you could use that to take some measurements, whether you used it for headers or just uh, to put in between your stickers or to put in between how I did the horizontal and I put washi in between each day. So anyway, you can pretty much use these however you want, whether you use big washi at the top or the bottom. So very flexible. So I am going to love using this. And again, that was an exclusive. And we get another book here. Something beautiful is on the horizon. It's a petite journal. And I did see some, I did kind of see someone complain about this as well, that they didn't want a summer journal or something. So this must be what they were talking about that, I don't know. You just really can't please people. Something beautiful is on the horizon. And it does say it's a summer memory journal. So I'm sure this is what they were complaining about. There's 80 pages in here. And let's see if I can see this. This is an exclusive, so this is not going to show up at the stores. I guess with the, uh, the layers here, you can write your name on it. Let's see if I can get to page one here. Let's see what it looks like so I can see what they are. Comparing. So it looks like there's places that you can put pictures in. And then maybe comment on the pictures, which, I mean, you don't have to use that. I mean, of course, you know, I mean, this was probably planned well in advance of people not being able to go any place due to quarantine and COVID-19. Uh, more space for plain space, an empty space, and some lined paper. So and I think this is good, whether you wanted to use it for like a diary or put pic pictures in. It gives you a spot to put the pictures to cut them out and put different shapes in. You could always just put stickers in there. If you um, see recipes that you like, you could put a picture of what it's supposed to look like and then a picture of what it actually looked like after you made it, the ingredients. I mean, so this is, to me, this is flexible. You can, it doesn't have to be about summer journaling. So again, it's one of those things. You cannot please everybody. But anyway, I think this will get some use. I'm loving that. And last item in here. It's on the go. It's a petite planner sleeve. So let's see if I can get this out, see if I can find it here. Okay, textured. So this is a sneak peek. It's clear glitter, petite planner sleeve. This will be available online or in the stores. Let's see if I can get it out of here because sometimes 
plastic sticks to the plastic and gives me a heck of a time. Speaking Minnesotan, gives me a heck of a time. I say that a lot out here. Heck of a Okay, so let's see if I can figure out how to put this in here. So it looks like this is pretty, so it would be, you know, I got those um, on-the-go folios that she has that this would fit in perfectly. And you can put a couple of different books in there. But if you wanted to carry something in your handbag and just wanted one or two things in there, you can put this in here, whichever, whichever um, petite planner you wanted to use, whether it was one for journaling, if it was one of the uh, ones for motivation or health planning or ones with dates. And again, it fits in here. It's sparkly, so it gives a nice thing. It fits right in here. Erin Condren on the back. Pretty sleeves, so you just put it in. So this will be a nice little protector if you wanted to put this in your handbag or any of the other planners that you wanted to put in there just to carry it around with you. I think that protects the cover. I think it looks nice. So again, that was everything in my box. And I'm thinking it was $49.99 plus shipping or something right around there. I know she says the value is always going to be about $80. And usually on this part here, at least the other few that I've got, they've all had uh, like a price dollar or dollar value here. And this time she didn't. And maybe it's because of the complainers. I don't know. But anyway, I like it. I'm glad I got it. I think there's really some nice, useful things in here that I like. I like uh, knowing that some of these things, if I wanted to get more, that it's going to be available at this at, online or in our store. Plus, when you do the rewards program with her, you get every time you buy buy something, you get points to be able to get discounts on future items. So anyway, I am loving everything in my Erin Condre by Summer Seasonal Box. Box is really pretty. And I can hear some puppies barking in the background, so I am going to cut this short. I hope everyone goes out, has a fantastic day. I'm going to enjoy my coffee, and we'll chat again soon, everyone. Bye-bye. Oh, I went the wrong way. Oopsie, I went the wrong way.